As E3 approaches, we will soon see the capabilities of both the Xbox One and the PS4. These next generation game consoles seem ready to bring forward improved graphics, enhanced gameplay, and high quality motion sensing. Some aspects of these game consoles, such as the policies and news games, have turned some people away from the new consoles even before the details have been released. But is there a third option? Perhaps. How about a virtual reality headset? It began as a smaller project intended to be sold on the website Kickstarter, and it was known as the Oculus Rift. However, this changed when it was found out by the Doom developer John Carmack, who showed it off at E3 last year. But why should we think any different to this virtual reality headset compared to the ones that have debuted in the past? And when will it be released? Well, sure, it's true that major companies such as Nintendo have released prototypes in the past, like the Virtual Boy, but the major difference between then and now is that the technology was not yet ready. To build virtual reality headsets back then cost thousands of dollars, and the processing power of computers back then is nothing like the power of computers today. On the Oculus Rift website, it is stated that there is not yet a release date, but my speculation is that it could be released as early as next year in 2014. The reason for this is that big game developers such as EA and Epic have begun to give support for their games on the Oculus Rift. On its release, it's likely that games such as Battlefield 4, Doom 3, and games on the Unreal Engine 4 could be some of the first features. So is this the next revolution in gaming history? Only time will tell as we wait for its release.